14. Read to verse yes, 16. Sir. Matthew chapter 13, verse 14. And in them is fulfilled the prophecy of Isaiah, which said, By hearing ye shall hear, and shall not understand, and seeing ye shall about, see. This is talking about the Pharisees in context, but I want you to understand something. This goes for anyone who decides to not want to keep the commandments, or they make that decision. Because who, who am I to say God is, uh, who am I to say that person's death is for destruction? It's, a, it's all dependent upon the, de the decisions that they make this day. You get on Clubhouse, you hear that, you're A1, you're E, you're Z, be real, say, hey, out of the scriptures, the Bible says, this is how you love God, keep the commandments, and ye shall live. Yada, uh, whatever scripture that they give, what, what question, the cor corresponding question, and you decide to say, well, hell no, that's not the case. To hell with what the Bible says, this is what I believe. You've made your decision right there and then whether you're, you're, whether you're going to be saved or not. You understand? Whether God has sealed your eyes, we do not know until uh, Christ comes. Why? Because it says, he that endureth until the end shall be saved. When the end comes, you sh your work shall be declared. All right? So let's read this scripture and get some understanding. Verse 14. And in them is fulfilled the prophecy of Isaiah, mm -hmm. which saith, by hearing ye shall hear. Mm-hmm. And shall not understand. You're going to hear the word of God and not understand what's being brought to you. Come on. And seeing, you shall see and shall not perceive. Seeing, seeing everything being brought out, seeing all the prophecies being brought up, you won't even understand the times of the end. We see that day in and day out. We have people like that. They see that the Lord said prophets are going to come forth and bring forth the word of God. The bones is going to rise up. Uh, understanding shall increase, so on and so forth, and still not understand that they are in the end days. They're going to see uh, the bishops, Bishop Nathaniel, Bishop Yahweh, South Bishop, can I bring out certain words from Israel United in Christ and still not understand that they are talking about the end times, pro professing that we are in the end times and not understand what the hell is going on. You have people like that on Clubhouse to this day and on TikTok. Go ahead. For this people's heart is wax gross. They said their, their hearts are waxed gross. Some people are so damn evil. I we to the, to the to that point. We had a sister. I think it was the, the artist Lil Baby. I think it's Lil Baby. She said sex doesn't count if he don't last more than three minutes. What in the whole audacity are we talking about? What? what? Yes, she said sex does not count if it doesn't last more than three minutes. She said with a what? condom too, Gabe. Yeah, with a condom. What? So I, with, so I guess I condom. guess majority of men are still virgins. Exactly, Shamir. So these are the things that we're dealing with. <laughs> these are the things that we're dealing with. This is the wicked, the gross times that we're dealing with, that gross darkness. Go ahead. And their ears are dull of hearing. Go and ahead. their eyes, and their eyes, they have closed. Lest at any time they should see with their eyes. It said, and their and eyes they have closed, lest at any time they shall see with their eyes. This is why they can walk past the prophets with no with no shame, with no guilt. You understand? Because they don't want to see. Why? Because when you when you come in front of the prophets, what's going to be revealed? Your sins, what you need to fix about yourself, your your fallacies, and actually the greatness within you. But people don't focus on the greatness; they just focus on what they got to change. Be that as it may, that's why they close their eyes. Go ahead. And hear with their ears, and should understand and, and should understand with their heart, and should be converted, and I should heal them. So the whole point of all of these moderators, A1, ZB Real, E, all of these men, Judd, that y'all referenced earlier, all of these men, the message that they're teaching from the scriptures is to heal you. If you don't want to hear that, you don't want to be healed. Because ultimately, God is using these men to do what? Heal you. All right, read on. But blessed are your eyes. This is the part I want right here. You say you understand, Jimmy, and a, a, amongst a few others. Blessed be your eyes. Come on. For they see, and your ears, for they hear. You see what's going on. You see the end times. You see the prophecies and the understanding being brought out. You hear it and you understand it. Blessed are your eyes and ears. 